By the end of this video, you should be able to solve 6 divided by 6 divided by 6 divided by 4. And if you have not subscribed to the channel, please do. I'm trying to reach that 1,000 subscriber mark. And please support the channel by subscribing. And let's begin solving this problem. The first thing I need to do is uh, turn these whole numbers into fractions. Because, hey, we know that any whole number can be written as a fraction just by putting the whole number over 1. So 6 can be written as 6 over 1. Because if you divide 6 divided by 1, it gives you 6. So let's go ahead and make all these whole numbers 2 into fractions. Next, we're going to start working using the, and I'll write it here, the keep, change, flip, method and working towards the right so we start from the left and we keep going towards the right and so the first thing we'll do is we'll look at the first part which is six over one divided by six over one and we'll keep the first one then we'll change the operation and then we'll flip the second part so let's go ahead and do that so it'll be 6 over 1 times, because we changed the operation from division to multiplication. And then we flip. So the 6 will go at the bottom, and the 1 will go on top. And you're probably wondering, why, why um, are, are we working um, from left to right? Well. That's because all the operations are only division. So that's why. And we'll be able to solve this problem by the end of this video. So let's go ahead and multiply across. 6 times 1 <clears throat> is 6. 1 times 6 is 6. And 6 divided by 6 is 1. And know that we can write 1 as a fraction as well, 1 over 1. And I'll do that here. 1 over 1. Now that we got this part and this part done, and now we have a new part, now we look at this part, and then we divide by this part, the third part. And we'll use the keep change flip method again. So we'll keep this, we'll change this division to multiplication, and then we'll flip 6 over 1. And so let me go ahead and write that over here. 1 over 1. And then we change the operation. And then we flip the 1 over 6. And then we multiply across. 1 times 1 is 1. 1 times 6 is 6. And we got that part. Now we're going to use this part and divide it by the last part of this problem, 4 over 1. So we'll use, again, the keep change flip method. And we'll keep the first one, 1 over 6. Then we change the operation from division to multiplication. And then lastly, we flip the last part, 4 over 1, will be written like this, 1 over 4. And then we multiply across. So 1 times 1 equals 1. 6 times 4 equals 24. And there you go. So the answer is 1 over 24. And there you go. Again, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please do. And thank you for watching. Easy. You can do it. Let's go.